morning, Marcus Footman. Today is Thursday, November 16th, 2023. It is an A-Day. I'm Robert, and here are your morning announcements. Let's start with a look at today's weather. Today will be partly sunny with highs in the lower 60s. Tomorrow, showers are likely with highs in the lower 60s, and the chance of rain is 70%. Please sign up for the Ski and Snow Sports Club now. Purses go up soon, and registration closes before Thanksgiving. See Mrs. Alvord or Mrs. Frank for a blue packet today. Attention all juniors and seniors interested in touring SUNY Brockport. There will be a field trip opportunity on Wednesday, December 6th to meet with admissions, tour campus, and have lunch in one of the dining halls. See Mr. Silco for a permission slip or if you have any questions about the trip. All permission slips are due by Friday, December 1st. Here are this week's club meetings. Today, Thursday, November 16th, Art Club will be in the High School Art Room. The High School Theater Program of the Fine and Performing Arts at Marcus Whitman Central School District is proud to present Anatomy of Grey by Jim Leonard on November 17th and 18th, 2023 at 7.30 p.m. When June's father dies, she prays for a healer to come to the small town of Grey so no one will ever suffer again. The next thing she knows, a tornado brings a new doctor to town. The new doctor cures anything and everything, but when several townsfolk take ill with a mysterious plague, it begins to spread. Set in Indiana during the late 1800s, Anatomy of Grey explores themes of death, loss, love, and healing through a unique coming-of-age story. Tickets are $8 for adults and $6 for senior citizens and students. Tickets will be available at the door the evening of performances. There will be a five-hour pre-licensing course on December 6th from 4 to 9 p.m. This course is required to take your driver's test. The cost is $35 and you must pre-register by December 5th at 3 p.m. Registration forms are outside room 511 and if you have any questions, see Mr. Prusinowski. Now here's a look at this week's events. That's it for today, Whitman. This has been Robert with your WCAT News Announcements. Have a great day.